Um, review of the all natural zero waste uh, dishwasher detergent. It suds up really well. <laughs> so I realized I bought dish soap instead of dishwasher detergent. Learn your lesson. <laughs> so I thought it would be fun to show you all what I do to feed myself. Drink your water, folks. So as of right now, I literally have no idea what I'm going to be cooking. Um, but we're gonna look in here and think of something creative. It always, it always starts out this way. I just got new Tupperware, so now I feel like I can meal prep a little bit better. So, I have a lot of quinoa that I will use, and I'm feeling a bowl. I'm just gonna do a bowl. Peanut sauce that I made yesterday. Okay, well. Purple cabbage. I try to make it as colorful as possible, but for some reason I always resort to everything being green. And it's like not bad, but you need to eat the rainbow, you know? Sweet potato that I will roast. Oh, I have some oyster mushrooms as well. Because they, ah, mm, I just stuck my tool. <laughs> Fuck. Oyster mushrooms, they're, yeah, they're so good. Typically if they start to like smell stanky, don't eat them. If they're slimy, don't eat them. They kind of replace meat. This cutting board is super, super organized and amazing. If you're an avid cooker, it's it's definitely worth it. But there's all these little um, thingies that come out and you can place all of these on the sides of your cutting board. So you can kind of chop and slide like each thing into each compartment. A little bit of the shallot. Spread them all out. We preheat our oven to 400. Massage your kale. I forgot. Chop up garlic. So I've got the shallots, the oyster mushrooms, and some minced garlic. I'm gonna put it in the pan with a little bit of sesame oil and just saute it until I can tell that like the shallots are soft. Stir that around. Oh my god, I just got this melon yesterday. The sapo melon. They're like the perfect mix between honeydew and cantaloupe and they're so sweet and so yummy. And... I'll start making my plate all pretty. I'm just gonna plop it on the plate. Nice. Okay. I'm just gonna plop that on there. Pretty. That is an overwhelming amount of <laughs> red cabbage. Yes, I'm just gonna eat it with a spoon. <laughs> Just wait for the potatoes and then I'll put some salt on top and eat it. I'll show you the final product when the potatoes are done. <laughs> the final product. Nothing is better than sweet potatoes and peanut sauce. You know? Because I know. Mmm. This. I eat like this frequently. Um, I find a lot of enjoyment in cooking for myself and for Mark, and it makes me feel good. So that's why I eat the way that I eat. It's healthy, it's good for the environment, and there's really nothing more to it. Treat your body with love and it'll love you back, you know? You heard it from me first. Probably not, but. It's a muk mukbang. Muk you only get four of these. <laughs> what? What's called? What's what is what's what's it called? Where you eat food and you talk. It's a muk mukbang mukbang. There's figs, vegan, and gouda cheese. Mm. Holy f beep! We're gonna replace that with the actual swear word over our beep. <laughs>
<laughs> and you're like, fuck. <laughs> That's so funny. That's such a good idea. Oh, oh you are such a bitch. Your second one? Get off my dick. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs>